In this video, we will learn how to add a theme to WordPress 3.9. Make sure to subscribe to Hello2WP for up-to-date video tutorials using WordPress. Log into the back end of your WordPress site and let's get started. Once you're looking at your dashboard, roll your mouse over Appearance in the Administration menu and click on Themes. The Themes page shows you themes that you have currently installed. To activate one of these themes, simply mouse over that theme and click Activate. If you want to search for a new theme, WordPress 3.9 has an excellent theme browser for you to peruse. At the top, click the button Add New, which brings up the theme browser. The theme browser displays themes from the WordPress.org theme directory. These themes are designed by third parties and are available free of charge. You can search for different themes based on keywords, authors, or tags. Or, if you have an idea of certain features you want your theme to have, you can search using Feature Filters. Themes can be filtered by Featured, Popular, or Latest. As you can see, 2014 comes up with a checkbox and a notification that it has already been installed. This is currently a default WordPress theme in WordPress 3.9. As you mouse over available themes, you can click on Details and Preview to see a description of the theme and a preview of how the theme will look. The preview displays how images and different elements show up as you format your pages and posts. For now, we are going to install the Sparkling theme. You can either install directly from the theme preview or mouse over the theme preview box and click on the Install button. As soon as you hit install, the theme automatically downloads and installs itself to your WordPress site. From here, you can return to the theme installer and browse for additional themes, or you can preview how the theme will look on your site using Live Preview. From the Live Preview, you can begin customizing the theme right away and activate it. Activating the theme means you're making it visible to the world when they visit your site. Once the theme is activated, you'll see the notification bar with the green line to let you know the activation was successful. You'll see that 2014, or whatever theme you were previously using, no longer shows up as the active theme. Let's go ahead and visit the site to check out our new look. Please note, when activating or installing a new theme, you will want to revisit your widgets and menu to make sure they transfer over, as some themes have different types of sidebars and areas where the menus go. For information on adding a new theme, either through cPanel or FTP, see the description below. Thanks for watching. If this video tutorial was helpful, please make sure to like it. Subscribe to our channel for more videos using WordPress.